Lakeshore Drive is a mess right now. We're on Randolph and Monroe, where traffic is being diverted by Chicago police. They deployed more troops to help assist with that as traffic is closed on the northbound lane from Randolph to Grand, creating some traffic disruptions there. They're hoping this is all cleared up by rush hour today or later into the evening as crews are trying to fix some damage to a support beam on Lakeshore Drive. This is what it looked like, actually, a big crack inside the structure. It was first noticed around 10 yesterday morning. Fortunately, before anything bad could happen, two steel beams have those cracks. The Office of Emergency Management believes the Arctic blast could have been a factor in what caused this, the erosion from it warming and then cooling, warming and cooling. And because of that, they shut down a portion of Lakeshore. And with the combo of that and these icy conditions, you really want to be careful out here. CDOT is warning drivers to expect lots of delays as traffic will be slower, especially going northbound. They expect to reopen this evening, but that's only going to be a temporary fix with more construction expected in the coming week. So to reiterate this for you here, northbound Lakeshore Drive is closed from Randolph to Grand. Eastbound Randolph closed between Columbus and Lakeshore Drive. You can exit northbound at Randolph and Wacker, and you can still access the uh, northbound Lakeshore Drive using lower Lakeshore across the river. This is definitely one of those mornings you uh, want to plan ahead as it's also icy and really nasty out. And if you can, take the Dan Stevenson, the Dan, the Dan Ryan or the Stevenson Expressway for a different route into the city. For now, I'm live from Lakeshore Drive. Branson Pope, The Jam.